Welcome back to Let's Play Mountain Blade Warband with me, Steven Tobias. So, uh, first thing I'm gonna quick save. And then we're gonna see if, without much health, I can do the tournament. Place a bet. 50 denars. Go ahead. Fight in the next round. Alright, we got this. Stephen Bloody Tobias, mate. Not just Stephen Tobias, but Lord Bloody Stephen Bloody Tobias, mate. Alright, that one didn't count. Alright, let's try again. There we go, much better chance that we got the sword and the shield. Come on, mate, let's go. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nice. Great stuff. We made it through to the second round. Of course, I'm, I'm used to going all the way in tournaments, so that's no surprise to me. Right. Come on, greens, let's go. Not going so well this time. Trying to do a sneaky double hit there. Numbered, but never outgunned. That's a real shame. That's a real shame. You have been bested in this melee, but the, the Master of Ceremonies declares a recognition of your skill and bravery, allowing you to take part in the next round. You're at Tier 3 of the tournament, with 16 participants remaining. In the next round, there will be two teams with five fighters each. Place a bet. Alright, come on. Alright, this is not... This is not uh, this is unlikely to succeed, but you never know. Useless. Somehow we were able to get through that. In my opinion, I don't think we were deserving of getting through that. We'll bet I'll ask if I have denies on it. Okay, yeah, no, we're not going to get through this one. No bloody way. Champion fighter over there. Okay. Put our chances at about forty percent, maybe.
Oof. Right, that was uh, extremely close. Extremely close. Right. I will now into the semi-finals. Lord Stephen Tobias. That's me. Hide Blade, Hide Blade, and Mercenary Swordsman. Some really tough, stiff competition. Well, sometimes you just get unlucky. Sometimes you just get unlucky. Well done. Congratulations to Mercenary Swordsman. He was the better man on the day. And that's all there is to say about it. Vanguard. Nah, mate. We need to uh, need to hold on to some of our money. All right. Yeah, we lost all of our money betting. Right. Not going well. We'd really do with a um, with a ransom broker. Disappointing defeat. Really not something that I'm accustomed to. Uh, Greetings, if you have any prisoners, I will be happy to buy them from you. I want to sell all my prisoners. 169 dinars for the four prisoners. Yep, that'll do. Brilliant. Right, so now we got a little bit of money. We can at least pay to stay in a tavern. Right, some looters. Could be easy money if we can. Uh... All right, now we're in debt. And Bunduk looks upset. Here we go. Brother, I, sh I can't say I like to see us not be able to pay the men. You should treat your men with well, and they'll repay you with interest. Uh, your objection is noted. Now fall back into line. Right, forest bandits. Can we take them on? We've got five, uh, five men that can actually use their weapons. We do need the money. I've got full health. Okay, it's going to be a struggle, but at this point, do we really have any choice? The answer is yes, we do, but... Got a history of making uh, some questionable choices. Those of you who followed me in the campaigns will know. Plus and minus numpad to move and one, two, three, eight. Right, we were crushed anyway. So not ideal, really. After painful days of being dragged about as a prisoner, you find a chance and escape from your captors. Hopefully we'll have better luck next time. 